Hey friends, I'm Pastor Joe. Today is Thursday and I have your word for the day. Do you remember a moment in your life when something that you hoped for was finally realized? Maybe it was a job offer. Maybe it was the birth of your child. Maybe it was your wedding day when you finally married the spouse of your dreams. We've been on a journey with the Israelites the last several weeks, and today their escape from Egypt is finally realized. After the 10 plagues, after Pharaoh's defiance and refusal to let the Israelites go, after 430 years in captivity, Pharaoh agrees to release the Israelites and set them free. Exodus 12, 42 says this, on this night, the Lord kept his promise to bring his people out of the land of Egypt, so this night belongs to him. The people of Israel, they had lived in Egypt for over 430 years, and it was on the last day of the 430 years that all of Israel left that land of Egypt. God had promised freedom, but it took time for the people of Israel to gain their freedom. Maybe that's you today. God has promised you freedom from addiction. God has promised you freedom from drugs, from alcohol. Maybe it's just from your attitude or from doubt. God has promised you freedom from fear and from anxiety, from pornography, from your temper, from hatred. And maybe you have surrendered your life to Jesus and committed to follow him, but you haven't yet experienced freedom in all of those areas. Let me reassure you, God wants you to be free. God wants you to walk in freedom. So begin to demonstrate self-control. Don't conform to the patterns of this world. Ask God to transform you into a new person who walks in freedom by changing the way you think. And I promise you, if you invite God to change the way you think, He will set you free from whatever is holding you captive. Why? Because God did not spare His own Son. And since he didn't, how much more could he possibly give to set you free? He's already giving you everything he possibly can for your freedom. God loves you. God wants you to be free. God has promised you freedom. So today, be set free. Let go of that fear. Let go of that hate. Let go of that doubt. Let go of your anger and walk today in freedom. The Son has set you free. Remember, you are free indeed. Live free. Love others and love your neighbor as yourself. God bless.